Hello and welcome back to more Sentinels of Freedom, a superhero game where you create your own superhero and join the Sentinels of the Multiverse in this Sentinel Comics RPG game. Uh, we of course are heavily awaiting what appears to be the paper copy of this game, which is the Sentinel Comics RPG Core game. And that tabletop game you can play with friends. This you come and play as your own team and so absolutely deserves its own merits. Shootout in the streets, we're gonna go ahead and go with this. We recruited Expatriate on our last playthrough and we're going to go ahead and keep her. The police are caught in a vicious firefight. Even worse, the criminals are holding up bus passengers caught in the crossfire. We have to help them before anyone else gets hurt. And so we have Expatriate, she has her Pride and Prejudice and Explosives, and then we have Nedonoski. Uh, he has the laser bots that have been upgraded, but otherwise very much the same. Let's go ahead and launch. All hands on deck, the police crew investigating a lead, sus or lead into a suspected criminal safe house. They found much more than they were expecting, a well-armed group that has immediately started firing on them as they cleared out. Not only are multiple officers pinned down in a firefight, the criminals are using a busload of civilians as cover. Uh, no time for jokes, we've got people to save. Heritage mentioned that reinforcements were coming. We're pinned down here, so listen up. We can't even get close uh, like this. They have the entrances covered from multiple angles, even worse. As soon as they pulled up, they hijacked the bus and took all the passengers hostage. Oh wow, this is bad. The civilians are the priority. We or we can't get near them for rescue. We can't advance while they're in the crossfire. And reinforcements won't be available for hours. Ugh. We'll draw their attention while you rescue them. Understood, officers. Stay safe. Keep your heads down, everyone. All right, and we're gonna, let's see. Anything here is gonna be in the firefight. We just need three, but I'm hoping for that heroic death. Okay, doing overkill seems to get additional AP. And either I misunderstood that at some point All right, let's. We're gonna move over here. We're going to have our laser bots come out, and our taser bots come out, and let's go ahead and open fire. Miss. That's okay. I've never been one to shy away from danger. Minus AP. Oh well. And a vigilance trigger. Well done. Okay, we are slowly pinging your health down. We have some more enemies. I like how the minions act as a group. The lieutenants always seem to be singular individuals. Ready. I've played the starter kit for the Sentinels RPG game, and I gotta tell you, that's a lot of what it appears to be. Let's go ahead and get three turrets down, since we're gonna be pinging anyways. And then what I'm going to do is... We're, we already have you most of the way down. We do extra damage with our pings against you. And we'll just keep taking you down. Oh dear. Maybe I should just change.
Okay, she keeps breaking their focus, lowering their vigilance count. Um, yeah, let's do that. 40. Not super heroic, but that's okay. Let's switch to Pride and Prejudice. Oh, super heroic. Achievement unlocked critical. What is that? Score 50 critical hits. Oh, whoops, I pressed the button. So AP up, and... That won't finish you off. But we might finish you. We did. Beautiful. I'm gonna switch to that. And I think when we get the chance, we'll have Nidanoski go and rescue the people from the bus. Just that massive AP bank that we have. Um, it looks like we're gonna need our turrets out. Because doing this summoned a whole bunch of enemies that we now have to deal with. And I'm gonna switch back to minions. And we'll get some taser bots out next time, I think. Okay, you'll escape. Very nice. Yeah, we've pulled all four, now we just need to make sure they get saved, and I think with our own vigilance attacks, we're going to make sure of that. Ready. Okay. Let's move as far as two will move us and see what we can do. Oh, very nice, actually. Very, very nice. Ready. And, okay. How much exactly does that cost? That costs five, so there's no way for us to redo this. And then, a Claymore just isn't gonna go off. So I'm gonna hide back over here and we'll end our turn. And I think I'll do two tasers and two lasers. And I'll end my turn. Our tasers seem to be the best at movement. Alright, that's one saved. Yep, we're gonna open fire on you. There you go. And you're gonna trigger a whole lot of attacks. I mean, this, in comparison to the last mission, it seems a bit easy, but that's what I said at the start of the last mission. Well done, all the civilians have reached the perimeter safely. Now the job gets harder. Get back here and we'll fill you in. All right. We'll do. Yeah, let's go talk. We have one SP. Look out! We need to make us a path, for, or make a path for us to get to the back. If you can get those in position, we'll have a clear line to the rear of the building. While taking the front, we'll go through the back and sweep the building. Expect heavy resistance. <laughs> resistance. I'm pretty sure it'll be futile. Okay. First of all, are there any enemies? They're not. We're gonna run over here, move, and there's going to be enemies, so let's switch to our turrets. They're gonna get shot, aren't they? Alright, and we have expatriate. Oh, I should have moved as far as three would allow. And then I think I'll switch back to Pride and Prejudice until we know more about what we're dealing with. Pride and Prejudice just allows me to be more precise and do more single target damage. I think more. For the 5 AP, Explosive Rocket is... Alright, we have enemies. Where are they? Ah. 
will do. That is okay. And yes, let's well Let's put the shock in place, shall we? We'll do. And then run away. Keep the gadgets. And move here, I think. And we'll just end the turn. So you've taken 28 damage so far. All right, and then we just need to give the signal. Where's the signal? Is the signal back here? Is that the signal? Ah, we need to get back to her. That is okay. Since I expect I'm gonna need to deal with additional damage. Ow! Yes, 14 damage. Okay. And you two are down, which is always nice to see. Yeah, minions act as a group. I am actually... Oh, misclick. Well done. Uh, you take out the blockade and keep their attention. We'll head through the back. Good luck, officer. So now we have... Let's see, move the car out. Um, not quite. I'm gonna put you... There. 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 That still leaves us with additional turrets to place. So there. There. And there. Then I'm not gonna use my last SP, we're just gonna switch back to minions. I've got your back. Oh yes, please, just open fire on everyone. Okay. We'll deal 14 damage to him and hope. Oh, I think we got him. Yes. Oh dear, it's just gonna take forever for me to get there. Um, can I rocket jump here? No. And how much is rocket jump? It's a three cost, so move as far as four will allow me. And I'll move there. Time for a change. Okay, we're gonna be able to open fire again. And you're down. Looks like you could use some backup. Come on, he only has one health left. They both only have one health left. All right, that's fine. All right, and there's no more. There's one enemy behind us. I'm going to move up here, and we're going to switch to explosive. This should get us killed more than likely so apprehend the criminals let's do our laser turrets our laser drones and our taser laser we're going to be able to switch to our gadgets and still load out our turrets so we have unleashed our full arsenal to try to break in and that's perfect. Uh, I'm gonna keep on gadgets. 
And we're just gonna, you know, sit back, relax. I'm gonna take a nice sip of my beverage and watch my units do their work. The thing I like about this is I could go through and make a new hero and feel like I'm having a different experience than what I'm having now, and that is really, really great. I'm thinking of doing that. Okay. We have our explosives that we can deal. I cannot use more than two AP. And let's see what we can or can't do. That was satisfying. I've got your back. I've got your back. I think another one of Just those will be perfect. Malaise. Unfortunately, Looks so like many enemies are going to have an opportunity to go first. I've got your back. And we still had all these turrets from laying them down before. Oh, we do get some sentry fire off. Don't get caught. Not a lot. Okay. Oh, you know what? Let's do this. I'm going to move up. We are going to set that down there. And then... How much HP do you... Oh, wow. You have too much. Too much AP. Or HP. I'm going to try to take out the street sniper with our shots. It worked. And then I'm going to do the soldier. What rank are you? You're still a lieutenant? Alright. We'll stick with that. Um, for Shockbot, let's move closer. And let's move to you. Yeah, I'm thinking those cops back there should really support us and shoot. Are you really taking out our tur- Oh. You took out multiple units. That, I suppose that's smart. And really, let me read this claymore again. Medium range deployment of a weak unit that interrupts moving enemies. We'll lay down a couple of them and then... I'm gonna switch to pride. Come on, fire! There we go. AP minus one. I've got your back. All right. We only have one SP, so I am going to surround myself with turrets. Promptly move over here. and start taking down you. So we've gotten rid of most of our distractions. Last two shots. Stick with you. And you know, doing five a piece, that's 10 damage per turret. So that's, oh, nope, it's not sticking. Ready. Okay. We have our hollow points, which is greatly increases damage potential for a short time than a long range attack that deals moderate damage. And I think that's going to do it. Perfect. So we will wait for the enemy to approach and trigger all of our turrets. I'll end with you. I'll end with you. Get our, a get our SP up anyways. I'll end with Try you. Something. And there we go. So Megalopolis Sentinels of Freedom rescue hostage from armed insurgents.
And that one went well, especially compared to the last one. So, one thing some of you may have been wondering on these missions, uh, protecting peaceful park protest. I've been avoiding that because I played through it a little bit, just felt a little too real. What happens is uh, the villains are placing uh, armed units into the peaceful protest to break it up and then you ha you're dealing with um, rescuing the real protesters while violently attacking the non-real protesters and so I am avoiding that for now I don't, I don't know if I'm gonna do it but I did play through it and considering recent events it, it just didn't feel fun playing it I'll say that is the nicest thing uh, but we are going to come back with Sticky Situation. So let me know your uh, thoughts on the campaign so far. It's been a lot of fun doing what we've been doing so far. And we're definitely looking forward to this game as it continues on. I am Nidinoski, and as always, have fun.